welcome back to my channel today we're going to make yucca root so I have here whole yucca root that I got from Kroger's or any grocery store um, to, we're going to actually uh, make it in two ways one I'm going to actually smash and put masala and cook the other one we're going to make as a boil and now uh, we're going to actually make a chutney or a sauce to go with it so let's go ahead and see how we actually have to take off the skin should have a sharp knife to do this so cut off the edges and then cut it into small pieces and then we're going to just take a side of it and keep peeling it really hard so you can't use a peeler for this make sure you're using a sharp knife so this is ready so to boil it I'm going to just cut it into half and then we're going to wash it first we're going to put it in um, double the quantity of water and boil it until it's nice and soft the masala version we're going to actually skin it off first and we are going to cut it in a different way so we have it here now we're going to actually cut it in small small slices so there is a small thread inside here. Make sure that we're not using that for our masala version. So just take it like this. Then flip it over. See, the thread inside will come out automatically while you're cutting it from both ends. So we're gonna throw off the thread. So that's how you do after cleaning the pieces really well i have um, doubled the size of water and we're going to cook it until the pieces are well done the current pieces are getting cooked let's add some salt just try to poke the spoon inside to check if it's cooked still not cooked but make sure that we're not overcooking this pieces unlike the masala version so we're cooking for another two minutes on medium high and we're going to strain it and rinse it run it under cold water as you see the boiled version is ready so it's not really overcooked it's perfect this can be served with our chutney that we prepared Let's go ahead and make the chutney or the sauce for the boiled yucca root. I have here half a slice of green chili. You can increase the quantity of green chili if you like it spicy. And half a cup of onion, chopped onion. You're not going to grind it in your fine paste, you're just going to crush it. Salt, as per taste. One teaspoon of coconut oil.
a teaspoon more of coconut oil and mix it well. chutney is ready so let's check if the yuca root is nice and boiled after rinsing it really well make sure that you rinse the pieces really well so i have here the masala version really washed well and i have um, double the size of water soaked in water i'm going to cook it until they are really uh, nice and tender make sure that you don't overcook those pieces make sure I mean when you use a spoon or fork to cut it and check it will not be mushy it should be really uh, cooked but not overcooked so it's almost getting cooked let's go ahead and add some salt mix it well we're going to drain it out and run it under cold water. Let's see how the masala yuca is looking. So see it's more cooked than the other version. So we're not going to over smash it. Just make sure that there are small little pieces and it's not over gooey. Let's go and make the masala. Let's go ahead and make the masala for the masala yuca root. I have here half a cup of onion, one teaspoon of cumin seed. You can, uh, I'm using here fresh sliced coconut. You can use shredded coconut. Half a cup of shredded coconut, one green chili, one teaspoon of paprika, one teaspoon of turmeric, and one teaspoon of cumin seed. And salt as per taste. Let's uh, not grind it, just crush it. A teaspoon of coconut oil and grind it again. To this, we are going to add one club of garlic. Pan, add one tablespoon of coconut oil. To that, add a few curry leaves, mustard, one teaspoon of mustard seed, and a few dry red chili. To that I have added the masala that we prepared. Cook it for one minute and then we're going to add in our boiled yuca root. Let's go ahead and mix the masala to the yuca root and cook for two minutes on low heat. The yuca root two ways ready, the plain and the masala one. Hope you like this recipe. Please like, comment and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.